So here I have a 2021 F-150 Lariat with a Gen 5 3.0 Whipple supercharger. This truck belongs to Whipple and this is the very, very first truck that was converted at Whipple in Fresno, California. And it's located here in uh, Detroit, Michigan for some testing. And today I have the privilege of driving this truck for the day and uh, uh, just to see how it feels and stuff like that. I've driven the older 2018 trucks with the Whipple and then even older than that, driven 2011 6.2s. And um, I have some experience with Whipple and we are a Whipple supercharger dealer in Arden, North Carolina, Amtec Solutions. Check us out, get on our website. If you want a Whipple supercharger for F-150 or anything else, that Whipple makes, we can get it, we can get it installed, no problem. So let's get to this truck. So this is a Lariat and it's got, it's got all the options. It has the screen, it has the nice shifter that hides away. Uh, turns out the shifter, I thought you could hide it away as you're driving. It only hides away when you're in park. Like if you have it in gear, it won't hide away. I guess that's a safety thing. They don't want you to uh, have this table out and eating sandwiches or making sandwiches or whatever so they only have that option when you're in park which is pretty cool and you know heated cooled seats has the drive mode sport mode um, my favorite if you have a whipple on here uh, my favorite is the four auto you put that thing in four auto and you know you don't lose traction it just grips and goes so uh, this is a nice truck here uh, We're gonna be driving it here in a minute, but I'm gonna do a walk around real quick And just to show you We're next to the highway, so it's pretty loud but this truck could use a wash right now, but We'll try to find a car wash Here in a minute I love this color this color is just on point. And uh, the Whipple itself is uh, actually gold. So let's take it on the test drive. So, you know, when you're driving a Whipple powered vehicle, you got to be wearing their merch. Always represent Whipple. So, let's put in drive. I'm actually going to pick up a passenger. He's in, uh, he's still inside the hotel. I don't know where he's at. We're going to see what this thing can do. Damn. Oh, this thing is a monster. It's <laughs> a monster way. Just take it down the street. Me? Yeah. No. Not yet? No. No, I was waiting for you. Make sure you buckle up. Um, Check for kids in the back. You might want to edit that out. <laughs> you think? What's up with all those people? Like a whole bus? Why they gotta be those people? I'm probably gonna have, like. You think you could like stand over here? I'm gonna do a launch. This road sucks though. Mm, not far. Dude, you know you didn't have it in four auto. Yeah, it did. It wasn't. It was in two wheel drive. Well, and we were looking at the gauge, and it was showing the front wheels. <laughs> <laughs> Get there. Uh, yeah, we have to turn right and just go straight. And stop. Like that's where I launched the Harley and Platinum.
Dude, I love the wine. Like, my car needs to do that. Is that not a Whipple? Yeah, they don't have a Whipple. We're in Mexico. So all this driving is going to be done on a closed course and we're professional drivers. Please lie. No. Professional drivers. Don't try this at home. And stay in school. <laughs> Dude, the transmission shifts just like that, you know? It's like 10 speed. Like in my car, I'm over there, like, <laughs> shifting gears. Dude, I'm legit thinking about selling my Shelby and just buying an F-150. Yeah? Because, dude, I can pull a trailer, a boat, everything. I can't pull that with my Shelby. It's useless. You wanna buy my Shelby? <laughs> Uh, try to do a 6.7 diesel. Deal. My Shelby comes with a payment, though. <laughs> uh, hmm. Six seven does not, so I'll have to decline. <laughs> I think I'll hit decline. <laughs> so you're driving this truck today, how do you feel about it? <laughs> but you're on a non-public road. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you're off-road. This thing's a beast. Yeah, I couldn't keep up with you on the little uh, Fiat. <laughs> What's the one that's supposed to come out in 2022 or whatever? The, the Raptor? It's, yeah. Was it, was it engines? They thought it was supposed to be a, a 5.2. Yeah, yeah. Like the GT500 engine, but I don't know. I don't know if it's passing the test or what. But they have 5.2 with the, the, same, in, the same, dri same drivetrain that comes in the GT500. But this is faster, bro. This is a 775 right now. 775 horsepower. And I feel every horsepower. Can you feel that? Calm down. <laughs> oh, you know what? It doesn't have the pedal shifters. Do some have That's what's them? missing. Yeah, the Raptor has them. I don't know about just regular f Did that Shelby one have, have it? I don't think so. I don't think so. Well, I mean, you can manually shift right here on the shifter. Yeah, but I mean... Who does that? Just 10 I'm speed just... the way it shifts, like... <laughs> hmm. we, might, we might need bail money, dude, here in a minute. <laughs> sucks because you can't talk when you have it. <laughs> so. Oh, look at that. I wish they would disable that. Yeah. I don't want... It's usually disabled on Whipple stuff. That's the <clears throat> stage one. It's not the same. Uh, yeah, this is stage two Whipple. Uh, Gen 5 3.0 stage two 775 horsepower, big throttle body, 
Big injectors. Big supercharger. It's better, bigger, or bigger. <laughs> This dude trying to go in the Buick. <laughs> <laughs> he looked at us, he's trying to race. Look at him, he's trying to go. He gave the nod. <laughs> he blinked. <laughs> he's probably like, what in the world? <laughs> Football players stop playing and we're looking. Yep. Look at that, the test track is right there. Yeah, probably totally. Oh, look, all the F-150s are gone. They were parked all around that. Around that ramp? Yeah, everywhere. Uh, probably could have hit some hay on that ramp. Yeah, we just made a huge circle, dude. Yeah, wow. Well. It's on the test course. Yeah. That we're on. Yeah. <laughs> we're gonna go on there, we're gonna turn right. <laughs> These cars around us are all fake cars. Yeah, paid actors. Yeah. Like this guy right here, this pizza guy is fake. And that's the <clears throat> director from The Fast and the Furious. Yeah, S streets closed, pizza boy. So, did you figure out if this thing drives itself or not? I didn't get that far. I was hoping to send it right here. No. I did that on the, the 6.2 back in the day. This rope was bumpy. Maybe they fixed it by now. But <laughs> the rear end was just yeah, jumping. That, yeah, that truck was like bouncy. You want me to videotape outside? Yeah. Just, Yo, if, just back up. And Yo, if a uh, cops are coming, I'm bailing. So <laughs> get an Uber. <laughs> like going like this. Dustin's gonna send me a bill for some tires. <laughs> he sees this video. Dustin tires were bald when we got the truck. Right? We can go either way. That way is back to where we came from. traction off and I'm in 4 auto and we went sideways. Mm -hmm. You feel that? Oh, no. uh, mm -hmm. Probably should turn the traction back on. <laughs> Let's go right towards. Go right. Oh, that's going towards two. One more. Ready? Mm -hmm. It just looks funny for a truck to be this fast. Like, you know, like Mustang's fast. That's, you know, it's like a sport car. But a pickup truck going this fast? Yeah. Let's 
stop on this racetrack. <laughs> is there? <laughs> yeah, this, this racetrack is big. Like, there's different locations. So if you're looking to modify a 21 F-150, this is pretty much the only option. Uh, and probably will, will be the only option for a long time because nobody uh, else can tune these. So, I mean, it's Whipple or nothing, you know. So, and I say Whipple because why not? Uh, this kit, this kit was just released two days ago and they sold like thousands is what I heard and I think they're actually getting shipped and this is a production ready truck here with the stage 2 uh, stage 2 setup so and it's EPA certified in all the states it's 100% uh, street legal so if you're on the market for an F-150 or you already have an F-150 uh, check out Mtech Solutions and uh, we are located in Arden, North Carolina, and we can do the installs. And uh, install takes about a day or two, but I'm not sure about the lead time on these kits as of right now, because I know they're a high demand. I don't know how much parts they have in stock to get the kits out, but um, they're usually pretty quick. This is like a very popular item right now, the 5.0 F-150. and. Um, I'm sure they, they have a lot of parts on the shelf already, so place your orders, we'll get it installed. We won't do this to your truck, what we just did with this one. This is a test vehicle on a test track with professional drivers. Just recording some data, that's all. Yeah. This truck already has 6,000 miles on it. And it, the, the Whipple kit was installed on this truck, I think less than two months ago, in Fresno, California headquarters, Whipple headquarters. And the truck was driven across country to the lab, past emissions, and it's 100% production. And there's no lights on the dash or anything. Like, it drives amazing. You hit the throttle, it shifts like that. I mean, I have no complaints. Instant power. Only complaint I have is like no traction. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, four auto, you got plenty of traction. Still, well, when you have traction on, I feel like it's like it's not doing it. And then you seen what happened when I, I was going like 30 or 40 with the traction off in the four auto, and we went sideways. Just be careful in the rain. <clears throat> like maybe three quarter throttle, that's about it. Unless you're on the track. <laughs> Red light, you know what that means. Drag race. <laughs> on the track. This guy's totally trying to go, dude. What's up? <laughs> Maybe he's trying to go for real. <laughs> So I'm not doing anything. I mean, I'm on the public roads now, so I'm just gonna keep my cool. But also follow me on Instagram, um, and I post a lot of stuff on there before I make the YouTube videos. And uh, we drove another truck today that is it's gonna be after this video, that and a it's beast. a little bit. It's a little bit of an upgrade from this one. It's still Whipple supercharged though. Yeah. But the price tag is a little bit higher. <laughs> like this truck, uh, there was a window sticker. So you can get one of these trucks. This is Lariat fully loaded, like 65 grand. Whipple upgrade is around nine, 10 grand. And uh, you roll around with 775 horsepower. With, with no other mods, by the way. Just a Whipple kit upgrade and it comes with a tune, obviously. So just that kit alone, 775 horsepower. You don't need any kind of colder intake, no exhaust, no. Um, I mean, you could, that's on you. 
you don't you need can. it. But like, <laughs> well, like that one truck I whip pulled, uh, the customer wanted the the long tube headers. Long tube headers, and you know we released the truck with the check engine light on, but he was okay with it. I would not be okay with it. I'd rather keep it, you know, stock. Yeah. Maybe like a cat back. <laughs> I'll do like a cat back. But I'm sure we could probably get a tune fix for that too. No, you, you can. Special order. Yeah, you can. It's, uh, but then, the, the, technically, then it's not like emissions friendly. This is like a street legal, 100%. Like, yeah. you can pull up to an emissions test right now and pass. But if you start messing with the cats and all that, then you know, it's, it's kind of like on you. And uh, I'm sure it avoids the warranty also, like the Whipple warranty, if you mess around like that. I know for a fact that this truck right here will smoke my Shelby G350 <laughs> because like on my Shelby zero to like 80 is a burnout <laughs> yeah, get why are we in the... where are we at <laughs> I don't know don't you have directions to the hotel no. <laughs> what were you looking at this whole time? I was looking for something else, but <laughs> I didn't realize how far we traveled. <laughs> yeah, I've never been here before. <laughs> Sketchy. Keep left. You ready, Nobody's gonna believe. No one's power. gonna know. No one's gonna know. You know, like if you drive a truck and uh, after a few pulls, like your legs are shaking and going like to sleep, it's probably the right truck for you. Probably got enough horsepower. Like and subscribe and stay tuned for the next video where we test drive another truck like this but a little bit. A little bit more up. A little bit more what? Oh. <laughs> yeah. It says a little bit taller. It's a little bit different color. It's all pro edition. Yeah. Yeah, so stay tuned for the next video. Like and subscribe later.